All right, so welcome back. Today we're gonna to be looking at traffic capacity and flow theory. We'll be going through a few different problems um, in the transportation section that I think is gonna be very key for you as you're studying for this civil FE exam. So let's look at number one. It says, um, for a highway segment, the free flow speed is 60 miles per hour and the jam density is 160 vehicles per mile. Calculate the speed using the Green Shields model when the density is 80 vehicles per mile. All right, so we want to start by saying, uh, or looking at what we're given, all right? So what is the information that we're given? Well, we know uh, free flow speed, free flow speed is 60 miles per hour. We know that uh, we have a jam density. And that is 160 vehicles per mile. And we know that the regular density is 80 vehicles per mile. All right. So um, that's all the information that we're given. And uh, what are we trying to find? Right. Well, we're trying to find the speed. And we want to uh, use green shields model. All right. So let's uh, do a search, right? Because I'm thinking we're probably going to need some um, formulas from the FE manual. So I'm just going to do a search in the FE manual for green uh, shield. I can spell green shields. Um, I search, there's only two things that come up in the FE manual and look at here. So, all right. So traffic flow relationships. And so based off the given information, we're looking for speed. Um, speed is according to this S. All right. So, um, the formulas that I see that we can use is this top formula S equals, and I'll zoom in so you all can see a little bit better. So S equals SF minus SF over DJ times D. So what is, so basically now we just want to check to see if we have the variables that we need so that we can find the value that we need, right? So what is SF? the theoretical speed or free flow speed, right? We have SF, that is our 60, okay? And then DJ, that's a, DJ stands for jam density. We have that. And uh, what about our other variable, which is D, which is the regular density that is in vehicles per mile. So we have everything that we need to solve this. So let's go ahead and Solve it out. So S is equal to um, SF minus SF over DJ times D. All right. S is equal to uh, 60 minus 60 over 160, and I'm just plugging and chugging, times 80. All right, so once you go through that, you should get S to equal 30 miles per hour, or C. I hope that you're enjoying this video. I just wanted to drop in and say if you're looking to pass your civil FD exam within the next 90 days, 
then you definitely want to check out the course that I've created. The video that you're currently watching gives you just a glimpse of what is in the course and I have made it test taker proof. And what that means is, is no matter if you've been out of school for a while or you just have trouble with some of the engineering concepts, if you study this material that is in the course, it will help you to pass within the next 90 days. There are also full practice exams. Yes, 110 question practice exams, along with review guides and study schedule templates to help you pass. And these, re these are resources that I have created for you. So if you wanna check out any of those, just head down in the description box below and check them out now. Now to stay up to date on any new videos that I drop, whether it is more practice problems like in this video, or if you want advice and some extra tips to help you pass your civil FE exam, you're gonna wanna make sure that you hit that subscribe button, turn on those bell notifications so that you know exactly when I post. And if you wanna check out the next video, you can here.